Anton Krell, Anton Krell Review, Institute of Trading and Portfolio Management. Is Anton Krell and the Institute of Trading and Portfolio Management legitimate or is it a scam? Remember, everything that I say in this video is my opinion. Please do not take anything I say as fact. Do your own research. In my opinion, Anton Krell and the Institute of Trading and Portfolio Management is a complete scam. I'm going to include additional information where Anton Krell and the Institute of Trading and Portfolio Management were caught leaving fake reviews on Facebook. Additionally, I'm going to include a video that includes Emmett Moore's review from tradingschools.org of Anton Krell, where he essentially says that there is no verified trading history of Anton Krell. And Emmett Moore believes that Anton Krell's claims that he helped build up the trading desks at Goldman Sachs and JP Morgan and Morgan Stanley are completely fabricated because there is no verified proof that Anton Krell is who he says he is. In my opinion, it seems like Anton Krell is just simply a run-of-the-mill financial advisor where he is a Lambo boy who's a little bit older. I want to very briefly discuss the trading programs that Anton Krell offers. He offers three programs. Each is around $3,000 for one year access. Here, this is the Professional Options Trading Masterclass. You can see that he has 30 lessons. In my opinion, he's trying to overwhelm the person and the student with information. That way, when they don't succeed, he can always blame them and say that it is their fault for not understanding everything. Next, you have Professional Trading Masterclass PTM. This is also $3,000 for 12 months. Here you have about 36 videos. You can see that this is extremely long. It looks like there's about 25 hours worth of content here. A lot of this, in my opinion, after looking at it, it just seems like it's overwhelming people with information. A lot of these gurus try to impress people with their knowledge, but unfortunately it's not actionable and it's not going to help their students make money. His final course, is Professional Forex Trading Masterclass. In my opinion, virtually 100% of retail Forex traders are going to lose money. And here you have an extremely long course. This video alone is over three hours. You have about 30 videos. This looks extremely long, around 35 hours. So again, it seems like the goal of Anton Krell is to overwhelm people with information, advanced computational methods, etc., macroeconomics. It just seems like it's a complete excess of information that the student is going to end up being confused. They're going to make bad decisions. They're probably not going to complete the course. And then when they fail, when they spend a lot of money, when they waste a lot of time and they're not successful, the course provider can then point the finger at the student and say that it is their fault for failing. When you day trade, you are virtually guaranteed to lose money. When you trade Forex, it's actually worse. I would say that there's close to a 100% probability that you're going to lose money by trading Forex because you are subject to substantial counterparty risk from the quote unquote Forex brokers who are probably going to end up stealing your money. I would highly recommend that you do not waste your money by buying Anton Krell's programs, that you do not waste your time by studying his strategy because it is my belief that you are almost guaranteed to lose all your money by trading his strategy. He encourages you to trade Forex and in my opinion, there is close to a 100% chance that this strategy is a complete scam. So we've got a guy doing a review at 10.42, then at 10.44, then at 10.48, then the next day, then five minutes later, then five minutes later, then seven minutes later. It's just so ridiculous. If you click on any of these profiles, you see that uh, actually, they're created just before the review was done. Let's go here as well. Yeah, exactly the same. Exactly the same. Exactly the same. That's ridiculous. All these reviews, these five-star reviews, 
then there was another wave of uh, fake reviews as well here on the 3rd of November. All these people faking. Brief review of instituted trading and portfolio management. I want to go over what Emmett Moore from tradingschools.org has said. He says he, uh, he rates it a 1.3 and a 1 for honesty. And he claims that the Academy of Trading and Portfolio Management is yet another trading educator touting a fantasy lifestyle. So he's selling a lifestyle. Additionally, and this is really important, the performance history of Anton Krell is nowhere to be found. Claims of being a multimillionaire and retiring by age 25 cannot be verified. Claims of being the top ranked trader in the world while working at Goldman Sachs, JP Morgan and Lehman Brothers appear to be an alternative reality that feeds into the typical stereotype of the millionaire trader. And finally, why would any world-renowned trader sell a $20 get rich quick seminar? The pros are world-class marketing and ex excellent salesmanship. The cons, world-class artist and probable online charlatan, no track record of trades, claims of prior history appear to be 100% marketing mumbo jumbo. So as we can see, these are his courses. He charges apparently $3,000 and then $7,000. I personally, I'm not against selling knowledge. My problem are the deception and the intent. So when a lot of these fake gurus try to sell you courses on day trading we already know that day trading is a scam and when they try to tell you that they can use technical analysis to increase your win rate and they encourage their followers to day trade penny stocks to me that's a huge issue because not only are their followers going to lose money by buying their course they're going to waste their time as well but they're actually going to lose their money trading and that's why a lot of these fake gurus, in my opinion, like a Timothy Sykes, their courses are meant to overwhelm people with 5,000 videos. And as a result, because it's virtually impossible for the student to get through 5,000 videos, then Sykes and other fake gurus can always point the finger at the student and say that it's your fault that you don't have the motivation to go through all of those videos when in reality in my opinion they're essentially selling you fraud and, and tactics that are never going to work back to anton krell this is also a huge red flag appearing on reality tv shows whether it's million dollar traders or wall street warriors i know that tim sykes appeared on wall street warriors also smb capital appeared on wall street warriors which um, you know, I think is kind of funny because I did a, a search for SMB Capital and they're actually not registered and none of their traders are registered. So I thought that, that was a little interesting. I might do a follow-up video on that. But um, you know, definitely it's a red flag that they appeared on a TV reality show. And I know that Tim Sykes was criticized by one of the editors, I think of Traders Monthly or something like that, where he said that they're more of a reality TV show and they're trying to play a trader on TV as opposed to actually putting in the hard work to, to become one. We began our investigation by contacting him directly. These are the questions that were asked. Apparently there's no information documenting his claims. So this is interesting. There is history of Anton Krell working as an investment advisor for Goldman Sachs, Lehman Brothers, and JP Morgan. Now, I'm not sure if this is on the retail or the institutional side. It doesn't specify, although there is a huge difference because if he's an investment advisor as in a financial advisor, then he's part of the retail sales team and he's not on the, on the institutional sales desk. If he's working on the institutional sales desk, desk and that's a much more prestigious uh, job that to actually obtain yeah so Emmett says that my mother has a registered investment advisor that advises her and has worked at JP Morgan for 20 years he's a vice president at JP Morgan one of the thousands of VPs at JP Morgan yeah so this is exactly what what I was saying that Emmett is getting at there's a huge difference between the retail sales team which are investment advisors and also uh, versus the institutional sales team where you're dealing with money of governments, uh, financial institutions, large companies, etc. Yeah, this is a corny little secret of big banks. Everyone gets a fancy title. But again, 
I, I can't even tell you how much more competitive it is to get a job working with institutions than it is with as a glorified financial advisor, which is essentially nothing. I mean, anyone can become a financial advisor. All right, so here you have a fantasy lifestyle. He mentions Tim Sykes. Yeah, so he mentions Cameron Foos here. I did a review on Cameron Foos earlier. So Anton Krell, his Facebook page is a testament to his supposed trading greatness and personal wealth. He even claims a rocket ship. I haven't verified that, so I'm not sure if it's accurate, but uh, I guess I'm just reporting what was said. So here you have, he actually looks a little bit like Elon Musk. Here it looks like, so this is the real important part. There is no performance history for Anton Krell. All of these shiny objects are meant to convey a virtual fantasy world that you too can be a part of for only a small fee. You can be a part of the 1%. It's all fantasy folks and these poor people got suckered in. Wrapping things up, nothing would make me happier than the supposed super trader known as Anton Krell to prove me wrong. So apparently the big thing is that he has no performance history. He believes that this is an accurate portrayal of you and I'm not buying your book about becoming a multimillionaire by age 25. No, neither am I buying the of building world-class trading desks at JP Morgan, Lehman Brothers, and Goldman Sachs. None of it adds up. Even the story of your rocket ship flying you to space appears to be pure BS. To me, you appear to be nothing more than a common charlatan. Right, so here is ripoff report. Totally disappointed with the overpriced and undervalued three-month mentoring program for $7,000. Simple technical indicators, don't be a victim like me. I feel ripped off and scammed. They will take your money and couldn't care less what happens to you. So look, I don't put much faith in online reviews. There are tons of online reviews, both positive and negative. I think the biggest thing to me is that there is no evidence that anything that this guy says is accurate, nothing. And that's a huge red flag to me. Here, just to briefly go through the review, it says he calls it dis this person calls it disappointed and overpriced, about seven thousand dollars. Technical indicators, this guy feels ripped off, or maybe it's a, a female. So to me, it's really interesting because on the one hand, Anton Krell is leaving fake reviews on his Facebook page, but then it's sociopathic how he believes how his opinion is the only per is the only one that matters because it's okay for him to leave fake reviews on his company's Facebook page, but God forbid someone else has an avenue to express their own opinions and beliefs, then suddenly Anton Krell is going to re respond and rebuttal that it sickens him how people can have an avenue to write totally unfounded complaints. Yet, if they have an avenue to write totally unfounded compliments, then Anton Krell is completely okay with that. 